My name's Sue Bon Taylor and I'm the Student Engagement Champion for the School of Social and Political Sciences. My student engagement project is called Youth Justice Live and it's basically a collaborative curriculum design project where we've put together staff from the school, students and local professionals from the Youth Offending Service um, to work together to design a new module um, to teach youth justice as part of our curriculum in the school. We wanted to um, look at how um, getting students involved might be able to improve student engagement in the module, attendance, student satisfaction levels um, and make it a more interesting experience for students and for staff as well. I was approached by our head of school um, who asked me if I'd like to be the school's student engagement champion and I think that's partly because I'd already done some work around the area so uh, we had a, um, an event as part of the ESRC Festival of Social Science um, where I got students involved with supporting that event and, and doing some um, analysis of the data that we collected during that event and then took them to a conference with it so I'd already been involved in that to some extent. Also my um, area of research interest is around youth and young people loosely um, and uh, so I'm quite interested in ideas around young people's participation in services, user voice um, and, uh, and collaborative and relational approaches to working with young people. So, um, so th there's lots of sort of connections between what I do in the classroom and what I'm interested in in my research and so I think those tied together quite nicely for the student engagement champion. So we've got lots of exciting plans for the future, um, partly in terms of developing the module itself, um, thinking about how we can continue to have students involved in that process. So even in the module it's, itself as it's been running we've built in collaboration and partnership. So for example I left week 12 free and said to the students what do you want to do in that? Um, and they said they'd like to have a, a guest speaker who was a young person who'd been through the youth justice system and we've made that happen. We've got someone from a peer-to-peer -peer mentoring scheme coming with them and bringing one of their service users to talk to the students. Um, but that was their idea for how to fill that space. At the end of the module I'm hoping to put together a new team of students who've who've been through the module to act as module custodians who will then look after the module over the summer period and develop it into the next academic year to make sure that it's fresh, it's up to date and it's fit for purpose and to continue working with the youth offending service so that we keep their buy-in through that process. Um, and then the other thing that's really exciting that we're hoping to develop is um, opportunities for working more closely with the Youth Offending Service, getting our students involved in doing pieces of research for them, involved in volunteering projects around some of the areas where they particularly lack volunteers. Um, and so we've got this kind of ongoing relationship now with the Youth Offending Team, um, which can only lead to great things in the future, I think. You can follow Youth Justice Live on Twitter at LincolnYJLive.